Hello Vinyl Community. I'm Mikko and welcome to my Vinyl Corner. As you can hear, I'm uh, I have lost almost lost my voice, but let's take some coffee if that helps. Uh, this time I'm going to show you some of my recent finds from November 2013. Uh, I made some kick-ass finds in November, but uh, in this video I'm not going to show any vinyl records. So if you are a vinyl purist, stop watching now and wait for my next video and if you want to see something else than vinyl uh, let's continue cheers let's start with some other drinks than uh, coffee here's murderhead bastard beer i haven't tasted this this yet but i bet it will taste very good then another beer uh, this is a beer from my local uh, venue or uh, club Tanssisali Lutakko from Jyväskylä this is their own beer and uh, this is limited edition and my copy is from the original pressing and this was quite good I have already drank this but luckily I have some more of these so those were the beers and I already also bought a couple of books this is also from my local venue Tassan Lutakko. This is their <coughs> history from the first their first two decades called Soumannin Katu Kolme and this book uh, includes lots, lots of interesting uh, details about the history and cool photos and list of all their geeks in there and highly highly recommended for for everyone especially if you can read Finnish very very good and interesting book and I went Tassa uh, Lutakko to see one of my favorite Finnish bands uh, Kolmas Nainen a couple of weeks ago and um, I was drunk as a skunk there, but uh, I bought some Kolmas Nainen stuff. And this is <coughs> the book from the vocalist and uh, singer, songwriter, lyricist Pauli Hanhiniemi. His book called Soitto on Sanoja, where he uh, tells lots of uh, lots of uh, interesting stories behind the lyrics of of his songs uh, very different book from um, ordinary band biographies but uh, very interesting to hear his stories behind the very good songs from the same gig I bought this cool Kolmas Nainen beanie with the band's logo and also their tour t-shirt where there's a list of, a list of the gigs in Finland and of course I have bought before the gig their latest album called Me Ollaan Ne and last time I showed, showed you their box set with their first eight studio albums and this is their ninth album 
I don't buy so many CDs anymore these days, but uh, this hasn't been released on vinyl, at least not yet. So I had to buy this. And very good, good album in my opinion. This gets better and better every time I listen to it. And uh, another CD. Uh, I won this from uh, from a radio station contest, Dream Theater, and their their latest album, and this is some kind of uh, limited edition with DVD. I bought, uh, I won also some other stuff from that contest, but I have already sold them, and I suppose I might sell this one too. I'm not a huge fan of Dream Theater. Let's take some more coffee if that helps my voice. From a brand new Moomin Christmas mug. Uh, <clears throat> okay, let's continue on cassettes. And of course, some Kolmas Nainen and this is their compilation or uh, best of album from 93 Kultahippuja I have this already on CD and I just found out that this was also released on on vinyl 2 double LP I have to get that that is one of the last items missing from my Kolmas Nainen vinyl collection. And I also bought their excellent studio album from 1991, Elämän tarkoitus. I bought this accidentally. I didn't remember that I already have it. Uh, but uh, what was interesting is that the cassettes Tapes are uh, slightly different from each other. As you can see, this is more more clear than this one. Otherwise, they are exactly the same. So they must be a different pressing or something. I think that's quite interesting because I haven't seen that kind of thing in Finnish finished cassette tapes. So nice find after all. Then I found also some Topi Sorsakoskiet Agents. This is their best of album Parhaat. And this was released by Valitut Palat, which is Reacher's Digest here in Finland. And I happen to notice that this was also released on vinyl back in days but it seems to be extremely hard to find so please let me know if you if you find this on vinyl then uh, one of my favorite movie soundtracks from one of my all time favorite movies Howard Shore and uh, Silence of the Lambs very very good soundtrack from an uh, excellent movie. Back in the 1990s I used to have this movie poster uh, on my living room's wall, but for some weird reason that poster is nowadays in our garage. Last but not least, I found some uh, blank tapes, but not just any tapes, but uh, good quality bus uh, chrome tapes. Uh, it was very nice find because it seems to be quite hard to find uh, good chrome tapes these days from here in Finland. Uh, I paid under 3 euros a piece. From these, I bought the package. I've already used 
couple of them I've made some some mixtapes and maybe I will send some of my mixtapes as a VCLT so vinyl community beware the mixtapes of the vinyl corner so those were my non vinyl finds in November 2013 uh, I will show soon my kick ass vinyl finds so Stay tuned, until next time.